Morning, I'm Katie and I'm very, very excited to be joined in the studio by a gorgeous young lady by the name of Jana Albalani. Hello. Hi, how are you today? I am wonderful. How are you, my dear? Great. Okay, tell me, you are here because you have started your own campaign called Smiles for Zayed. Tell me all about it. Come nice and close to the microphone because you're, I know you're nervous. <laughs> Don't be nervous because okay. I want everyone to know all about what you're doing. I think it's incredible. Okay. So uh, Smiles for Zayed is a project that I've been working on with a team of students to spread happiness and kindness in our school and the rest of the UAE. Um, so this campaign is, of course, as part of the Year of Zayed and in honor of it. Um, we first started off just really close in our school trying to motivate teachers and students to do simple acts of kindness around the school and hopefully later on outside of school. You got teachers involved in this? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, and then but it later on got even bigger and we started to push it out more like out into the community but while still getting that motivation going in our school as well. For sure. That's amazing. Thank now, wh what was the idea? Was there a competition you were saying about? Yeah. Um, so, Smiles for Zayed is competing against other schools in the UAE. Um, the competition requires the contestants to design, develop and implement a project that has a positive impact on the community and celebrates Sheikh Zayed's nice. values. So, um, you went with kindness and happiness? Yeah, of course. I just, I love the idea and even even coming out and seeing you outside when you were waiting in reception, just your smile and everything. Honestly, <laughs> if I can paint a picture for you, if you're listening wherever you are now, Jana is sitting in front of me. You're how old now, Jana? Uh, 13. You're 13 and just her smile, her attitude, it's so infectious. I think you're <laughs> the most, you so much. you're the best person to be able to do this. So why, my question would be, why did you think that kindness and happiness needed to be spread in the UAE? Now, UAE already tries so hard to have a positive environment, um, but as well, it's nice to keep it going. Now, what we're trying to do is not just do it once or make someone smile once. Mm. Now, we want to keep a chain going. So mm. today, if I make you smile, you go on and make someone else smile, and it just keeps going, and it's like a never-ending chain. Oh, I love this. Okay, so because I've got mum in the studio as well and I've got people because we're live on Instagram at iHeartUAE and I I feel really happy already just <laughs> just looking at you. And that's the thing. It, it is an infectious thing, isn't it, to come yeah. across. So what, you know, what have you done so far as part of the campaign to spread happiness and kindness? So, yeah, as I said before, we've already started in our school. Yep. We went around with a wheel, filled, like an electronic wheel, filled with simple acts of kindness. And every time teacher or student spins the wheel, we follow them, filming them the act of kindness they're assigned. Like what, what What kind of act of kindness? Especially one teacher. Like, what, what, Tell me yeah, about that. So it's something really simple like uh, smile to three people today or open the door for someone oh, or nice. compliment someone or say uh, like one of them was write a note anonymously to another teacher or a student oh nice yeah <laughs> I love this I think we need to implement this in our office today that's great yeah, yeah I, go around. I like this kind of idea and what kind of response have have you got you know have you've obviously had a, a big response to it yeah um it's obviously always been like uh that's a great idea or I want to be a part of it like a lot of people have wanted to be a part of it not just part of making someone smile but also working within the project like behind the scenes mm. going to meetings with us planning everything amazing yeah <laughs> I'm so pleased so the, the most important thing is is I want to know because you know if you're listening as I say wherever you are at home in the car and you're thinking I want to get involved and I want to help Jana and her team with Smiles for Zayed. How can people support you? Can they follow you? Of course. We have uh, two social media accounts, one on Instagram and one on Twitter. Good. Um, it would be lovely if everyone could take a look, you know, follow us at Smiles for Zayed. Smiles for Zayed with the number four. With the number four. Because you're cool. Yeah. Right. Okay. <laughs> that's right. Right. So Smiles for Zayed um, and that's following and supporting. And then can they actually get involved in the campaign of course if anyone would like to involve we have an email address if anyone would like to help on there uh we're always waiting for help <laughs> i love this so much jana I, I i can't i can't tell you and even as well if i can let you know that i i went outside to to meet jana this morning and her mum, and she brought me a gift <laughs> um and it's it's just the most amazing thing because it put a smile on my face and, and that's great that's what we want and that's <laughs> the whole idea jana alba 
Kabbalani and Smiles for Zayed. Please get involved. Follow it on Instagram and Twitter. That's Smiles, the number four, Zayed. I think it's absolutely fantastic. I'm so proud of you all. Thank you so and, much. And um, everyone at Heart 107.1 is here to support you. Thank you. You're very welcome. Thank you for coming in today. 